Good morning, guys. It is 11 o'clock in the morning on Sunday. I have not even gotten out of bed yet. She's hiding under the covers. So it was great to sleep in. Uh, it's only like 50 degrees outside right now, but we'll be going out later. Uh, it's supposed to go up to like 68, so it's still going to be a nice day. So I'm up. I'm out of bed. Um just have so much stuff to do. But, I don't think we're going to do any of that. Because, I want to go out. It looks nice out. Laundry can wait for another day. Cleaning can wait for another day. I'll put those dishes away later. So, we're heading over to Jenkinson's right now. She's just started reading Hunger Games. We picked that up last night at Walmart. And we are going over the um, Seaside Bridge right now. This is a view of the Seaside Bridge in off season. Um, later on this summer, I will show you a view of this in the on season, and it is packed, absolutely packed. It's a little foggy out on the island, but we're gonna go over the bridge, and we're gonna go left, and we're gonna go up the island because this is really the only way that I know how to get to Point, which is at the other end of the island. So going over to Jenkinson's and, and then maybe we'll try to fly our kite. I don't know. I don't know if it's windy out. Last time it was too windy. Um, we'll see what happens. So guys, we're about three quarters of the way there. This part of the island is the smallest part of the island. The bay is like right to the left and the ocean is to the right. All these houses that you really can't see, I can't really see them either, that are behind all these trees are like huge giant like rich people houses and all the houses on the left are the summer homes which are really quite nice it's a nice area over here i don't know how it is for flooding and stuff but it is the smallest part of the island i would say that it's it's probably like a quarter mile wide all right guys so we just made it to the point area where jenkinson's amusement park is uh, we'll park and then we'll go find the aquarium. The aquarium's open till five, so we got like two hours. It's actually kind of crowded down here. There's more cars than I would expect since there's nothing open. All right, guys. So we made it to Jenkinson's. Um, probably gonna go get some quick food and then go visit the aquatic life. Boardwalk is quite crowded. Uh, here's Martell's Tiki Bar, and back there, there's no sign, but that's Jenkinson's um, nightclub. Hi. So we stop for a couple of quick slices of pizza and uh, some fries before we go over to the morning. So guys, this is Jenkinson's nightclub during the day. Uh, it, it gets bigger, all those doors open, and it opens to outside. But this is it empty during the day. Okay, so we made it to the aquarium. This is the first tank. Yeah, I used to. Ha I had those in my fish tank. Hello, fishy, fishy. I know. Is a and ugly. Anybody else? Well, these are like what's in the ocean. Yeah. Well, they're big and ugly. No, right, okay. This guy next to me, he's just the expert at everything, right? <coughs> we've spent so, guys, this is a lot more exciting than my fish tank. I, I, I wish I could have John's fish tank. There's 70 feathers in that little circle. Uh, he probably went up. Yeah. Do I think they have to go to the top for air? Hello, Mr. Piranha. It looks like it has glitter on it. 
Yeah. Probably wouldn't see it coming. They do, they look glittery. But you pretty much stay together for the rest of your lives. Penguins get married in, in the South African world. Here, around three to four years of age, you are a full grown adult penguin. And from that start, you'll start having babies. And usually, you like two eggs. I have a pretty big assortment of stuff here. Uh, there's a big snake. And right now, we're actually on the dessert. What's a python? Oh, I failed to see the sign. Look at the size of the koi fish. That's the biggest koi I've ever seen. Sunbathing turtles. That's what I like about it. Uh, it's like hurting my eyes. Yeah. It could It's coming to attack. That's so scary. Look at all those teeth. He wants to bite me. He does want to bite us. He's trying to eat us. So, so G's freaking out because she's never been this close to <laughs> big sharks. So. I'm like a big kid watching everything. <laughs> Shark. Need some tiger sharks in here. So, in his so downtime, this lizard's this sleeping with its tongue hanging out. out. So, in his so downtime, this, this is where the gecko gecko hangs out. out. Funny, I know. I try. Froggy, froggy, froggy. Well, here's the alligators. Oh, they're cuddling. Wait a minute, you. Alligators are kind of boring. They just kind of sit there. So they got uh, penguins here. These penguins don't have to be in the cold. I love penguins. Look at them. Did we miss the feeding time, Jay? Hello, Mr. Penguin. Okay, folks, as you can see, our homeless show feeding has just begun. Anyone in the room that is not already upstairs, you still have enough time to join us for the feeding. And again, we have one upstairs, we ask everyone to put one of these rings here. And yes, you know, claws or seals or anything. So the top view of the shark tank. Yeah. Little baby turtle.
Hello, Mr. Power. There's a fun job cleaning up bird poop. We found a monkey. It's kind of hard to see back there. I love monkeys. Oh, look, there's look another the, one. Look at the brown one. No, that's not brown, babe. That's more blonde. Oh, sorry. He's just resting. You are great. So guys, they've added quite a few uh, exhibits since the last time I've been here, which was quite a few years ago. Look at the size of this American lobster. Uh, you can't even see him in there, he's so big. Jellyfish. Lionfish, this is the last tank that we've well, this is the last tank that we haven't seen yet. What the heck's it doing? Guys, I was just reading the sign for the blue lobster, and it says one in a million lobsters are blue. So that's pretty cool. All right, guys, so we're walking around in one of the arcades down here, um, which always seems to lead to me spending my money. But I hope for that's not gonna happen. So in the arcade, I'm um, walking around and I'm looking and look, the annoying orange has its own things. So we're walking the boardwalk, um, just enjoying, it's, it's a little nippy out, but we're just enjoying what we can and then uh, probably going to stop at maybe Best Buy. Uh, we still have to pick up steaks because Walmart didn't have them last night. so. Get some steak. Oh my God. So G Look, just picked herself. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish all of it. I don't know where to start. All right, so we're back home from going out. Um, we went to Best Buy, and they didn't have what we were looking for, which was kind of surprising. They don't really carry much software in Best Buy anymore. I guess everybody just downloads stuff now. Um, we got our steaks, finally got our steaks, we grilled them, we made them, sorry there was no videos to go with that. Today's video is like 40 some odd clips, so I started editing and I had the phone, I had my, my camera connected up to the computer, downloaded it and stuff, but uh, we're going to watch uh, Scott Pilgrim vs. the World because we've never seen it and G got it on promo at, during Christmas time, cheap. And she put a purple highlight in her hair, which is why she won't be in our ending video. Cause Sorry, I look ridiculous. Got tinfoil in her hair. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow.